Don Henley was a pretty happy guy this week. His End of the Innocence album is still a top 20 item after 14 weeks on the Billboard chart, and its latest single, The Last Worthless Evening, jumped 21 places to number 70 with a bullet. Henley, of course, has been chronicling the high and low life in Los Angeles ever since he moved there from Texas 19 years ago. And when we talked to him not long ago, he was feeling kind of reflective about the glory days of L.A. rock. The late 60s and the early 70s was a very exciting time out here. It was, it was all part of the 60s cultural upheaval. There were people in the streets, you know, all the way from Doheny Drive, all the way down to Laurel Canyon Boulevard. You, couldn't, you could barely drive through there. Just people were everywhere in the streets. And there were all the clubs like the Troubadour and, and the Whiskey and, and Ciro's and um, lots of clubs. There was a, a great scene going on here that spawned a lot of people that are still on the radio today. Uh, and um, I thought I was in heaven, you know. I mean, I was just thrilled to death to, to be here. And um, it all kind of fizzled out around 73, 74. You know, the times changed. But um, it, was, it was really something. <laughs> 